Hello there, John the Bird Vampire here. Welcome to another video. I hope you're all doing very well. Um, we are currently still in lockdown, but it is starting to ease up a little bit. Um, by the time this goes out, we might be um, almost back to normal. I'm not expecting this to go out for another couple of weeks, but I thought I know I'll record it now. Um, it's going to be a beard care pull up kind of review type thing. Um, I've been doing it on this one, which is their second ever product. Um, well, the second ever scent. And if you don't, if you caught that in there, it did say Bay Rum. It smells interesting. It's not the nicest smell, um, but it's a very popular scent. Um, as you can see, I haven't used this yet. Um, so it is a, a fresh kind of try. Um, I'll say the smells, to me, it's not the best smell in the world. It's kind of antiseptic kind of thing. Um, oh, oh, pardon me. But um, from what I've gathered and heard um, across the beard community, um, Bay Rum is a fairly popular scent. <coughs> Not entirely sure why. Um, but I've also got it in this little Orteous Man sample bottle. Um, because I, um, I sent off a, a kind of five cent kind of sample set. And that was one of them. Um, but as I say, it, this is obviously the green. Um, so I've taken quite a, quite a big chunk out of that already, look. Um, which is obviously like one of their newest um, product kind of things. It goes in, it smells a little bit better when it goes in the beard, but it's not, it's not something I would use a lot I don't think um, I'm gonna use it over a week anyway um, just to see what it's like um, see if I, it grows on me but I say it is a popular one for some reason um, a lot of places when they come out with um, a new company, quite a lot of them will have Bay Rum as a scent. Bay Rum, from what I can gather, it sounds a bit weird. I don't know if you, if you'll see you in the beard community, you might already know what it is. Um, but it is kind of like an aftershave um, cologne, eau de toilette kind of scent. Um, that's like an old fashioned one, which I think is why it's so popular because it's, it reminds people of like the old times. I'm not entirely sure. Um, but I don't know. My beard seems to be a bit tamer today. Because I washed it. I washed um, I'm mean, not going through without any knots, that's really quite cool. Um, but yeah, like I say, it's like a, an old fashioned aftershave scent. Um, I think it's like a like a, what you'd get if you used to have like a. Um, 
a razor cut shave at the barbers like an old fashioned kind of barbers that did like razor you, you, you cut throat razor wet shavey kind of warm towel kind of shave um, I think it's the kind of aftershave that they use when they finish kind of doing you up kind of thing I think for some reason that I've got this thing in my head that it's, it's a barbershop kind of scent um, I don't know and from what I've read it is but I might be misleading that I don't know um, but I'm going to try it like I say for the next few days I doubt I'll go a week um, because it's not a scent that I'm, I'm that fond of so you know what uh, I will last as long as what I can and then I'll do another review just to find it up so I'll see you all in the next part one week later okay so it's been um, a few days it has only been a few days because I can't stand to do it any longer <laughs> it isn't I don't like the smell um, as you can see I have used it there's a little bit of that gum there a little bit of it gone. Um, about three days, three, four days, I've been using it and I don't like it. It's not a smell I can get. It's, it's, it smells a little bit like hospital to me and that is not a good smell. That has really bad memories for me with my dad being in hospital quite a lot of time. So it's not a very nice smell for me. It's kind of like antiseptic -y kind of weird things. Um, I don't know. There's just something, there's an element in there that really kind of triggers nastiness in my head. Um, so, you know, it's... The product itself is fine. You know, the actual cream itself you know you, you don't need much of it it melts down really well because the beard well comes through well um the product itself is fine you know it's the same as all the other beard creams that they do you know that is perfectly fine but i just don't like the smell it is not a smell i can get on with um so you know i'm gonna leave it there um, because I don't like it. I can't want to rave about it. I can't. I'm sure it is a popular scent. Um, loads of people do it and loads of people buy it. Like loads of companies make a bay rum scent. It's one of their first kind of go to scents that they do as a new kind of beard company. Um, sort of like Archie's Man. You know, they've got a bay rum. I mean, I've got that I've got artist man's bay rum just there. If that'll focus, if that'll focus, if that'll focus. Okay. Oh, yes, man, bay rum. Now, that's just a little sample one. Obviously, the proper thing's bigger. Um. I bought that as part of a sample kit. Now, I'm never going to use that because I know that I don't like Bay Rum. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to leave it here. If you liked this little review, found it interesting, found it helpful, I'll see you all in another video. Bye.